It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Hogsback Brewery Company and it's a bottle of their Hop Garden Gold. It's 4.4% ABV. It's in a brown bottle and it's got a golden or a yellowy cap on with the Hogsback label on the top. Um, this is just another beer that takes me right back to my humble beginnings as a, as a beer reviewer on YouTube. Nice bit of smoke on the opening. Uh, a time where I used to buy beer from the supermarket. Um, I was a fan years ago. I think I had the Hogs Back Tea, traditional English ale. I was a big fan of it back then. I've had a couple more of their beers in the first two years of, e of me reviewing beer on YouTube. Uh, it's now going into year six. I've drunk a lot of craft beer from around the world and I just want to kind of gauge my uh, my palate, I want to gauge it to where it was, to where it kind of is now and, and will I still enjoy, really enjoy a traditional English beer, you know, the, the, from, from people like Hogsback Brewery. Hop Garden Gold is a slightly hazy coloured ale, it's got a one finger white head with nice levels of rolling carbonation. Uh, the beer was kindly sent to us by Lidl, Lidl in the UK. Um, they asked me if I wanted to review some of their beers that they're putting on their shelves now. They're expanding into um, quite good beer, uh, so they've decided to send some down to us. Let's see what we get. Let's get the aroma. Slightly spicy beer, a little bit of malt going on. Hop character is slightly there in a in a more of a traditional sense. It's like wet. The aroma is of, is of like a wet hay. Like laying in wet hay. Let's dive in. Cheers. And actually, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Um, we have reviewed more beer over the last few minutes, over the last 20 minutes. Um, if you want to check out the old Bob review, Ridley's old Bob, we reviewed that. It was okay. Another beer called Warwick Brewing Company, the the Bob, uh, Sparkling Bob, or whatever it was called. It was, you know, it was okay. This, on the other hand, has a little bit more quality to it. It's got a better quality of malt. You know it's 100% malt beer. Um, asked me five years ago and I wouldn't have been able to explain uh, what I was tasting, but one of the beers from Green King, uh, it was slightly, it's that kind of slightly uh, cherryish kind of flavor you get in, in, in your pedigrees, your, your old speckled ends. This doesn't have any of that. This, has, this is a 100% malt uh, bill. Uh, in the in the recipe for this, and you can really taste the quality of the beer. A little bit again of traditional bitter bitterness on the back end from the hop character in the beer. It's called Hop Garden Gold. I suppose if I had one criticism for the beer, they put the hop the word hop in big letters on the top of the bottle and then again on the bottom of the bottle and it's 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 a traditional hoppy hoppy flavor it's not it's probably about 20 10 to 20 IBU so it's, it's a slight kind of it's more of a kind of a it's not going to give you a rampaging bitterness that that some of the newer uh, younger breweries will um, but I suppose some people, the reason why I'm saying it's a bit of a criticism is because maybe somebody who's a little bit younger might pick this up and think, oh, I've heard about this hoppy beer, this hops, I'm going to try it. And it's not really as hoppy as perhaps it could be. But other than that, it's okay. I like the malt grain. I really like that kind of biscuity bready malt that comes through 
Um, maybe ramp a few more hops in it, but of course, the more ingredients that go in, the more expensive the beer becomes, and the more or less likely uh, places like Little are uh, of, of having it on their shelves. So it's all a balancing act. Would I buy this beer from Lidl's? Yes, I would. I would buy it over the other two beers, most definitely. Uh, rating for this beer, I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. It's a 7 out of 10 from Reno Craft Beer. Put your comments in the comments box. Check it out from Lidl. Uh, that's the Hogs Back Hop Garden Gold. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews on YouTube. And cheers.